travels. This is day two. <laughs> and I have had such an awesome day. I can't wait to show you all the stuff. But first of all, um, there are a couple of things I actually wanted to talk about. One thing I noticed, because um, I went to Ginza today, so it's like the shopping capital. And it was amazing, by the way. And so many high-end brands. Like, you got Louis Vuitton, Bulgari, uh, Chanel, Dior. There are so many brands. I'm just like... I don't have enough money to buy you <laughs> but it was really really awesome just you know have a look and like feel like a total peasant jeans and a t-shirt a couple things I noticed uh coffee coffee prices here are amazing Perth it's maybe about five bucks here three dollars yeah three dollars for a large is that not amazing? And the service as well, no matter, well, a couple places I was kind of like, mm -hmm. but most people, like everywhere you go, they're always saying, welcome, welcome to our store, and they're very, very helpful most of the time. But if you did that back home, if you go to the shops back in Perth and every store you went past, and everyone's like, welcome, please come inside, welcome, welcome, everyone would be like, shut up. <laughs> no one would like that, no one would appreciate that, or they'd be like, stop it. Talking to me, I'm shopping, I'm doing my own thing, putting my blinkers on. Mm -hmm. There is a real trend of three quarter cut pants or cuts, uh, sorry, pants that are um, cut above the ankle with a black shoe and socks. Like the socks are pulled up. I'll post some photos, I'll add some photos onto the video. And every, like, every second person, like when I was in Starbucks, three girls. They're like, don't even know each other. Three girls on the line all wearing like practically the same thing. If you if you wore that back home, people would be like, what are you? It looks cute for them, but if I wore that, it would look like a total knob. But uh, today, yeah, I went to uh, um, a very expensive uh, shopping complex. And today, for the first time, I actually got to try a thousand dollar dress. And I did, and I felt really guilty because I knew I wasn't gonna buy it, and the girls were ridiculously nice and helpful. It looked so cute. Uh, the photos are actually on my Facebook page, which is um, www.facebook.com slash candy troubles. Don't forget to like the page, that'd be sick. Yeah. So I've also got a couple of things I like to show you because I went to the stationery store today, and it was like a six story stationery store. Cake magnet, some cake erasers, some beautiful pens. That's just a simple little musical note with a calligraphy pen. Which is very very beautiful. A couple of stickers and whatnot. Uh, these these two are my favourite. These ones are bunny rabbits and uh, paper cranes. And then notepads. They just have walls and walls of beautiful notepads. They're absolutely stunning. Uh, this one's a bit of a impulse buy. It's just like a nice little paperweight kind of thing, and it's all pretty and stuff. It actually looks a bit better and a bit white. I've got this cute little thing for my phone. It's just a little cat. It's a bejeweled cat. <laughs> so cute. I got to go into the stationery store and down the bottom uh, was like a little art gallery and I came across this beautiful artist and she was actually there, I didn't realise, <laughs> I didn't realise this half but she was just a sales assistant. Um, she did some really really beautiful work and this is one of them, this is one of them on a postcard. It's absolutely stunning, like, it's very Alice in Wonderland inspired and she has so much of that art and I'm like I want to take you home. Mystic Elements 3, so I don't know if you're interested in that kind of art but she's absolutely stunning. Um, that's my shopping for today. And I've experienced so much today already and I'm so excited about tomorrow as well. Really looking forward to it, so stay tuned and I will post another video again tomorrow and heaps of photos as well. So stay tuned and thank you so much for watching, I appreciate it. Okay, bye! <laughs>